What's up, everybody? It's 3:42 a.m. Sunday. No telling what I'm, what time I'm gonna get up, and you guys gonna see this video. But um, you see my security, the new security company that I work for. They made me cut this off. Y'all like it? I feel like Martin Luther King. I don't know what this. Oh, did I make that up? I take myself up. Did I do all right? Oh my head look red. But um, anyway, survival mode. Um, I do a lot of thinking sometimes, and um, I was thinking about this random fact. I was like, I'm 20, almost 25, and I never had a car. Even though if I really wanted to before, I could have had one. But I just always hated the thought of getting something and then being taken away. As though, like, I get a car and then being repossessed, or the payments, or insurance, or the thought of not really needing it just becomes so overbearing. I just rather give it back to them. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like. I've been in survival mode for so long, for so many years, since I was like 17, 18. It was always something happening to me, like I get kicked out of my my mom's house, and I get kicked out of my best friend. When I get kicked out, I got into it with her boyfriend, had to call the police. He like punched me in the face. It's like it was always something happening. Then my ex was like uh, <laughs> abusing me. Like, it would seem like it was always something going on. Like, I have so many stories. Like, it was always something happening. And even when I was at work, well, no, work yesterday, I was thinking the fact, I never told you guys this story, but um, I was working at McDonald's a few years ago, and I got robbed with two guns to my waist. At my side, through the drive, through two guns. I could have been dead and gone many years ago, and I was just thinking of the goodness of God, like, how many times I have escaped dangers I saw, I experienced. It's different when you don't see danger. It's just, God's been so good, and I made up in my mind that whatever I want, I'm going to get. I'm going to be patient, I'm going to wait, I'm going to work hard and grind, do whatever I got to do, because if I'm going to get it, I'm going to keep it, in Jesus' name. This music, I'm always working on this music, always getting new songs, working on recording it and making the sound better, trying to be the best music engineer, producer, singer, songwriter, pianist, drummer that I can be, so when I produce it to the world, you know, you guys hear it, you know, I can appreciate it because I love it. If I love it, I know you guys like it, you know what I'm saying? The website, and, you know what I'm saying? The t-shirt, campaign, line, everything that I want to do, I'm just waiting. Wait, 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 wait. Because God's going to come through out of survival mode. I'm going to go into thrive and live the best life possible. I want everything to Um, So I'm not going to preach today. But um, I want you guys to stay driven. I thank you guys for all the inbox mes messages, um, the comments. People that share my videos, I just never want to take you guys for granted. I thank you, thank you, thank you for a thumbs up, like anything, any way how you support me. I thank you, and I want you guys to pursue your dreams. It's, I, I really do. I hate to see people living a life that they were not meant. To, you know, especially when they have so much potential. Don't let your whole life pass you by, and you ain't doing what you called to do. You ain't doing what you know how to do. All right. I love you guys. Stay driven.